This tutorial is going to cover transferring ownership of an animal within Digital Horses. First, you're going to log in with your member number and password. And once you're brought to your general profile information screen on the left-hand side, you're going to go ahead and choose Herd Management. And then Transfer Animals. We're going to search for a buyer. And we're going to uh, see if there's one in the system already for that person. One, two, five, three, eight. And we do have one here. But in case we did not see one, uh, the person listed, we would go ahead and click to create a new profile. And we would create a new profile for that individual. In this case, I'm going to transfer this animal to Frank Darren Costello. Today is going to be the transfer date, but I could always change this date if I wanted to or needed to. And we're going to go ahead and choose from the animals. In this case, I am going to transfer Rops Jake Stone. Okay, chose him. If I had multiple animals to transfer, I could always choose multiple animals from this list. If I've chosen all the animals I'd like, I can go ahead and close this window. And at this time, we're all set to transfer the ownership of this animal just by clicking on Process Transfer. You can see everything is green and all set to go. All transfers have been processed. And we can see that now. If we go back here, we're going to see Rops Jake Stone in our list here, in our legacy list. His ownership has now officially been transferred. And you can see here, it says transferred to lifetime members, Frank and Karen Costello. You can click on View and look under Ownership. And now it shows that Frank and Karen Costello purchased Jake's Jake Stone from us on 6-3-2018. You can also tell, if we go back to our account by clicking on View underneath My Account, that we've also charged for this transaction. In this case, there was already a $50 charge out there from an earlier tutorial that I did on D, uh, that would be a DNA charge. And then there's also an additional $35 for the transfer that we just did. And we could go ahead and click on Pay Online. That'll pop up a window where we can then put in the credit card information, click on Pay Now, and the transaction would be complete. This time, I'm just going to go ahead and cancel this. And we're going to go back over here to our main screen. And that's all there is to transferring an animal within the system. If you have any questions regarding transferring animals, you can contact Stacy Lynch at either slynch at perchandhorse.org or by phone 740-694-3603.